Let my family wake up your family. Hi, I'm Imus of the Morning. Join us weekday mornings right here on WNBC New York. And thanks for listening. NBC 66 WNBC. All right, we're thrilled and privileged to have a very special guest here with us this morning on the Imus of the Morning program, a person who is a, a true megastar in every sense of the word, a person who is an institution in the annals of American show business, and, uh, by the way, the subject of a most startling new biography. Please join me for, the, we have the chairman of the board, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Frank Sinatra. Yeah, 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 okay, so I'm welcome. Yeah. Fine, fine. So what uh, inane question you want to ask me? Well, I, I, I hope nothing inane, Mr. Sinatra, but it right. seems to me that you've been a pretty busy fellow over the years of your career. Well, yeah, of course I have. I'm like your uh, show business god, you know what I mean? Fine, okay, so could we discuss a new biography of your life? No, we can't. Good, let's start back at the beginning. So your mother was an abortionist, huh? Hey, what are you talking about? Well, it's right there in Kitty Kelly's book. Huh? Your mother was a neighborhood abortionist back there in Hoboken. So, look, since when is a housewife not supposed to have a little uh, part-time job on the side, huh? What about it? So she's a rabbit catcher. <laughs> hey, it didn't stop me. Well, no, Frank, I guess it didn't. But I, no. How about your father? He was once charged hey, with hey, receiving hey, stolen now goods. Now, wait just a minute. Hey, I don't like the way this here sounds hey, like it's Frank, gone. Frank, huh? it's in the book. The old man was a fence? <laughs> <laughs> How about that? Uh, 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 alleged fence, man. Right, well. As it, and it turns out, according to Kelly's book, that you went through women like you changed your shorts. I don't change my shorts, <laughs> Mr. Smarty. No. Hey, who is this guy, anyway? Uh, so you did have a lot of women, though, right? Hey, what are bimbos for, anyway? <laughs> but you are stupid, you know that? Yeah, and I, and, I, and I heard when you were just getting started, your press agent had to hire girls to go to your concerts and squeal. Well, of course he did. Did you ever see my uh, early pictures of me? I mean, I weighed 11 pounds. Who the hell's going to squeal for 11 pounds, you know? Well, I, <laughs> yeah, I guess it might depend on where it's located. Yeah. Huh? Oh, <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> hey, this Ned brings pretty f funny, huh? Uh, speaking of that, yeah. uh, Mr. Sinatra, your sexual prowess is really something else. Is yeah, that true? well, you ain't no, uh, what you call... Uh, well, I mean, women fell at your feet, right? Well, I guess they did, yeah. But I'm a, I'm a one-woman kind of guy. What are you, you know? talking about? You dumped your first wife for Ava Gardner. Well, yeah, but... And uh, then you got Elizabeth Taylor pregnant. Well, who didn't? <laughs> <laughs> you had somebody call girls up down to Wilshire Towers and it looked like a DAR convention. Hey, they was fans, all fans. Now, come on, Frank, a minute. You hose your way across the Vegas and Hollywood <laughs> landscapes like a fire truck. Look, my dad was a Fireman, so what's the problem? Who is this f idiot here? Uh, Frank, Frank, I'd like to explore for a moment your unsavory mafia connection. Oh, maybe maybe I should say alleged hey, connection. Hey, wait just a f minute here. <laughs> you still carry a gun, what, Frank? What are you talking about? Hey, I'm Frank Sinatra. I don't need no gun. Yeah, and you only went to high school for 47 days, huh? Well, you don't have to be no, what do you call it, in, in, uh, in uh, intellectual. Yeah, you don't got to be one of those <laughs> to be an entertainer, you know. No, don't. You don't have to have any talent either, right? Right, absolutely. Uh, moral compunction. <laughs> right. Well, I'd sure like to thank you for dropping by this morning, Mr. Yeah. Sinatra. Uh, do you ever read the book to Godfather? Can't read. Just as well. <clears throat> anyway, thanks for coming, Blue Eyes. Hey, it's old Blue Eyes to you, I'm old. Oh, yeah, you can say that again. Uh, I want to get Mr. Sinatra's shawl. I think he's facing that uh, final curtain. Hey, that's pretty f funny. I miss in the morning. WNBC.